Hello John, what's up? I was just scrolling through Instagram and just came across a post about Selena Gomez's best friend giving her a kidney. How is that even possible? Hey, Alex. It's called organ donation, the topic I was doing for my assignment last semester. Oh, what is that and how does that even work? Basically, we as human beings carry many organs in our body and in many cases, we even have the ability to survive without certain organs that we can then donate to other people who need it more than us to stay alive. Really? So are you telling me we have the ability to survive with just one kidney? Yes, but kidneys aren't the only organ we can donate. We can also choose to donate other organs after we die. How does that work? Does our organs work after we die? Yes, very much so. For patients awaiting transplant, organ and tissue donation can make the difference between life and death. One donor can save up to eight lives by donating their organs after death. What other organs can we donate after death? We can donate our intestine, kidneys, liver, lungs, pancreas and even our heart. Wow, I'm surprised I didn't know about this before. Thanks for this John. This was really eye-opening. Anytime Alex. I must say that I have little knowledge about this as well but since I did the assignment on organ donation last semester, I got to learn so much about this topic and now it's something I'm really passionate about. So do you consider donating your organs after you die? Yes, I do. You should look into this more and I'm sure you will consider it too. Yes, I should research more about this. The thought of having the ability to save lives even after we are dead is really interesting and something I should look into more to get a better understanding of it. Anyway, thanks again. See you tomorrow. Yes, I had the same reaction when I first came to know about it as well. See you in class, don't be late.